development proposals can be seen throughout our city, but High Park residents say their community is seeing more of these tower projects moving in and they're not too happy. I'm Faiza Amin, seven new towers are reportedly being proposed for this ward alone, and that's expected to double the community's density. I hope it doesn't change to like a negative impact, but you never know. From proposal signage to construction sites, these are signs of change in High Park, and residents aren't too pleased. I've been here for two years now, and there's been lots of just, you know, no, and people aren't happy about it. Construction is already underway for the two 25 story rental towers on High Park Ave. They, according to the area's councillor, were approved by the Ontario Municipal Board. But they're not the only ones moving into the neighborhood. Councillor Sarah Doucette tells us there's five more towers awaiting approval from the city, ranging from eight to 39 stories. A group called the High Park Community Alliance has been vocal about the projects, drafting this map of the proposed projects showing how the towers would have a negative impact on the dynamics of the neighborhoods. Residents are concerned about how the quality of life for those living there now and even for those coming in will change. There are also proposals along the neighborhood that would increase units in already existing buildings. And if the remaining five projects are all approved, Councillor Doucette says High Park will welcome 1,800 new units and double the density in the next 10 years. So residents are not anti-development. They're not not in my backyard. They're not even going to be the 25 meters separation which planning insists on. Mm -hmm. um, you're going to be looking balcony to balcony. You're not going to have space for residents to go and sit on grass and kick a soccer ball around. The council, along with residents, will form a working group to study current and proposed developments here in the area. Then they'll take that feedback along with their concerns and they'll present it to developers who have proposed a project in the community. By Zemin, City News.